Hey filmmaker Shungdi here. In this video, I'm releasing the Luma Fade transition. So this is an upgrade towards the Luma Matte. In the Luma Matte, you had to duplicate a clip. Right now with the new Luma Fade, you don't need to duplicate it. So this enables you to make this effect much faster and edit also faster. To get this Luma Fade preset, go to the link in the description below. You will land on this page. The most important section is this part. Press one of these buttons and this section will disappear and a download link will appear. And if you really appreciate what I do, there's also a donate button here below. Once you have downloaded the file, unzip it, go to your effects tab, right mouse click on preset and import the file. And then it will be inside the folder of Shunda presets, then in transitions and then of the folder of Luma Fade Transition. And also it says uh, overlap 15 frames. Uh, if you want it to be faster, you can actually use uh, less frames. And if you want the effect to be longer, you just have to make the clip longer or have more frames and then drop the effect on it. So the naming of the presets, DL is dark to light and L to D is of course light to dark. And the end of the in and out, so the out of course be at the ending of a clip and uh, the in is of course the beginning of a clip. So here we're going to apply the effect. So first go to the beginning of a clip, then hold down shift three times. So this makes it 15 frames and then cut it. And of course, this is at the end of a clip. So we're going to drag in the out. So this is dark to light. And now the out of light to dark. So it cuts away the brighter spots and then the dark. So that was the Luma Fade transition. Hope you guys liked this video and please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more upcoming videos, please subscribe. Also check out other videos on these channels. There's also a lot of other tutorials. If you have any questions, please comment below and I'll see you the next time. Bye bye.